This is Twit. Uh, move up the coast to Visalia, California, and Kevin's with his K6TD, and he's with the International DX Convention. Kevin, it's really nice to see you. Thanks for being with us tonight. Glad to join. Great crowd. Great topics tonight. Well, what else? It's the, the International DX Convention. How long <laughs> has that show been going, uh, uh, Kevin? When did this start? Uh, yeah, it started in 1957 in Fresno, California. 67, my goodness. And why is it in Visalia? That's always a question I get asked by a lot of people. Well, originally in 57, it was in Fresno, and then it moved to Visalia in 1978. And the reason it's in Visalia is a couple of reasons. It's basically a HFDX meeting uh, between the Northern California DX Club and the Southern California DX Club. And Visalia has a couple attributes that are useful. One is it's exactly halfway between Northern California and Southern California. Um, and you know the competitive nature of DXers, we're never gonna give the other guy an edge. Uh, the other aspect <laughs> of Visalia is it's uh, cheap hotels and cheap drinks. So a natural for ham yeah. radio. <laughs> well, that's really good. That's really good. Well, I've been, uh, been going, I don't go every year, but I've been to it several years and I really enjoy it. And what is so strong about this show over all other shows is it is huge into the workshops and all of the various forums and, and really a, a teachings that we get from the masters. And there are people from all over the world there. Uh, so it's, it's a really different crowd. I, I always say it's the serious operators that are there. And uh, uh, I, I really appreciate all that you guys do to put that thing together. I think Brian's got a uh, some of the uh, website stuff he can uh, pop up there for you. Uh, what what are you doing this year? Uh, uh, what they what they got you stuck with? Are you taking care of? I should say, Kev. <laughs> yeah, Bob. Thanks. I guess I would point out. I think the actual uh, interesting part about, or the thing that makes the uh, DX convention by Celia strong is, is of course all the W sixes that come. Um, so I actually co-chair the organization of the uh, convention this year, along with K6 Mike Mike and Kilo Echo One Bravo. Uh, John and I have been doing it for every other year for the last three years. It's co-managed between the Northern California and Southern California DX clubs at opposite years. So um, most of my activities this year have been making sure that things actually get done, making sure we have an interesting program, uh, making sure that the conference is something that people want to come to and enjoy. Um, some of the things that uh, we have planned this year, uh, we have a, quite a lineup of uh, different DX topics and DX expeditions. We have leaders from the Echo Papa Six Tango, the Tromlone Fox Tango Four Tango Alpha, uh, TX7G, the Three G. Uh, Reef is coming. Um, the Echo th uh, 30 Fox Baker from Betray is coming as well. These are all people that were on the expedition or leaders of the expedition. Uh, and a particularly interesting item this year is, is Don Miller. Uh, Whiskey Dine Whiskey November uh, Victor is coming this year. He will be giving a talk. Uh, so if you've not heard Don or if you haven't connected with him in a while, now is a great time. The convention will be a great time to do it. Um, the highlights of yeah. uh, go ahead, Bob. No, no, I said that's a, that's really something that Don's going to be there. I'm excited to see him again. Yeah, uh, that's what we've heard from a lot of people. People have been uh, calling us regularly saying, Is Don coming for sure? And I talked with him just a few days ago, and he is all set and fired up and ready to come. So, uh, good should be good topics from Don. Um, that's the uh, Sunday night. Uh, so the Saturday night banquet is typically a, a premier DX speaker. This year we have Gene Socrates, uh, Kilo Two, uh, Kilo Charlie Two, India Oscar Victor. Uh, she single-handedly sailed around the world. Um, so this should be an interesting talk. Uh, I think many people did work her. Uh, and then Sunday morning is the one I'm actually looking for very much, which is uh, Glenn Johnson, Whiskey Zero, uh, George Juliet. Um, he was one of the group leaders in the doctor on Navasso. 
So that'll be a very interesting piece to hear firsthand what the VASO presentation is like and what their experiences were, um, and we'll get a feel for what it really was like being on the island as part of the expedition. So that's a rundown of the things happening in terms of the speakers. Uh, if you go to the DX Convention website, you can see our full schedule that shows all the different tracks, uh, the other types of things we're having. And then on Friday, and on Friday there is a... Uh, uh, running of uh, twin twin programs running one is a contest academy for the contest oriented people and then uh, Wayne Mills um, N7NG is putting on a uh, DX university so those will be things for you to do on Friday and of course uh, probably the highlight of the convention is the attitude adjustment hour right before the uh, Saturday night. <laughs> <thing. laughs> Ah, that's great. That's great. I'm uh, I'm honored that I'll uh, be doing a little presentation on audio and uh, not not just microphones, but we really get into audio, uh, both receive, transmit, and how to make the transmitter better. And so I'm I'm honored to to be one of the presenters of that on Saturday. Well, Kevin, is there anything else that we've forgotten that you want to leave everybody with that uh, uh, about Vi uh, Visalia and uh, what they should know or uh, what they should be doing right now? to uh, prepare to come out to Visalia? Uh, come bring your fun. Come prepared to have a good time, see your friends, and learn something new. Right on. You will learn something new. Well, I appreciate you being here. Gordo, did you have any questions for Kevin before he uh, takes off? Yeah, no, I think uh, Visalia, the DX convention, is fun. And hopefully, Kevin, they're going to have the whistle off where everybody whistles CW and you try and see how many folks you can uh, uh, read their call signs via whistle. Is that right? Yeah, well, actually, Bob uh, Bob Heil had something special planned for that, so we're waiting to hear what the reveal uh -huh. is. <laughs> It'll be good. All right, thanks, Kevin. Thank you, Gordon. Great. Well, Kevin, uh, best regards to you. Thanks for your time tonight. And uh, we'll see you out there shortly. Okay. <laughs> Tell everybody help. Thank Thanks, you. Bye.